getting out for work this morning, I realized that the sun was hot that early hours, beyond normal. It got me thinking on how we can optimize the benefits of sunlight and how we can shield ourselves from its side effects. And that's what we'll be looking at today. So stay tuned, let's dive in. When we expose ourselves to sunlight, we give our body the opportunity to synthesize vitamin B from cholesterol in the skin cell. This vitamin B is very essential for our bone health. We need vitamin B to regulate our blood pressure. It is very useful in regulation of our immune system. Vitamin B is also very important in maintaining blood vessel. In men, vitamin B protects them from prostate cancer. This vitamin is essential because it helps to reduce the risk of diabetes mellitus. Vitamin D is very useful for our brain health. It helps to maintain a healthy skin. The list of those vitamin is endless. So for our overall well-being, vitamin B is indispensable. Then when we expose ourselves to intense sunlight for a long period of time, it becomes detrimental to our health. This intense long exposure causes dehydration and induces oxidative reaction in our body, which causes photoaging. Intense exposure to sunlight also causes sunburn, skin cancer, acne, wrinkles. So for you to have a healthy skin and optimize the benefits of this vitamin D, balance needs to be maintained. Knowing that vitamin B is obtainable during the early hours of the morning, clothing inhibits the synthesis of vitamin B because it inhibits the direct interaction of your skin with the sunlight. When the sun becomes unhealthy, that is between the hour of 11 a.m. till about 4 p.m., wear protective covering. Your clothes, your cap, your sunshade, or even your umbrella. Shield yourself as much as it depends on you if you must expose yourself to sun within this time frame to avoid being a victim of the side effects of intense sun exposure. Secondly, for those that are using whitening cream, must avoid using this whitening cream in the day. They should rather make this whitening cream to be their night routine and use normal moisturizer in the day. In addition to protective covering, it's also advisable that you wear potent sunscreen. Don't forget that using sunscreen, you're expected to reapply this sunscreen at intervals. Also, bear in mind that sunscreen cannot shield you 100% from effect of UV radiation. As much as it depends on you, avoid entering sun between the hour of 11 a.m. to 4 p.m., especially when the sun intensity is very high. During this period, you are advised to drink plenty of fluid, especially water or natural juice. Avoid carbonated drinks and canned juice. So wisdom is needed in order to know how to maintain balance between sun exposure and when to shield ourselves from effect of UV radiation, which comes from intense sun exposure. Till I see you in the next video, if you're yet to identify with Axe Dr. Anita, simply hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification. So when there are new uploads, we first can it. Don't forget that we have to do one like So we need to optimize it from all angles. Don't forget that you're in charge of your health.